स्वागत है सी सी वर्डी वेलकम टू जावा ट्यूटोरियल इन दिस सेशन आई विल एक्सप्लेन वन ऑफ द सोर्स एंड मेजर टूल फॉर जावा दैट इज सोनार लिंक इन दिस सेशन आई हैव टू पार्ट्स सो वन इज हाउ टू इंटीग्रेट सोनार लिंक प्लग इन विद द एक्लिप्स एंड सेकेंड वन इज हाउ टू एनेबल सोनार लिंक फॉर यूर डेवलपमेंट प्रोजेक्ट let us go ahead and first install uh, sonar link plugin for the eclipse start eclipse i am selecting my de default workspace location for the desktop so if you want to change you can browse and select which folder you want to create the uh, workspace for this project and click ok so now it will trying to launch the eclipse uh, ide so my eclipse opened up now in order to uh, install so sonar link plugin uh, for eclipse go to help click on uh, market place is trying to open up the eclipse marketplace here uh, type um, sonar link click enter here you go so you see sonar link click on install button now select sonar link and click confirm now it will ask for the uh, accept the license so click on uh, i accept the terms of the license agreement and click finish now it is trying to load all the required um, jars and the uh, settings to enable uh, sonar lint on our eclipse and it will take a while to install the thing so let me pause the video once the installation completes uh, eclipse asks for to restart the eclipse so that uh, sonar lint will uh, reflect to the eclipse so click on yes now it will uh, restart the eclipse i am selecting my default workspace if you want to change it you can change to as per your uh, required uh, directory i am going with the default workspace so my oh, eclipse opened so here i have uh, my default uh, uh, project uh, which is Core Java. In this, I have two programs. One is uh, in that I have package com dot shiva java tiki dot core java. In this, I have two uh, classes. One is hello world program, and uh, another one is uh, uh, this program is to connect it to the JDBC. So, if you if without enabling the sonar link, if you see, we do not see any uh, warning messages or uh, such as of now. But once we enable the sonar link for this project, it may give some uh, warning messages or the guidance for the developers which may have some uh, issues with the code. So, how to enable sonar link for the project? Right click on it and go to configure. Configure. Now, here we have an option for enable sonar link. So, click on enable sonar link. Okay, now it got enabled. Now, in order to analyze the source code, again, once again, right click on it, go to the sonar link, 
and now click on analyze all the files now what the sonar lint will do is it will try to analyze the source code of all the java file which are placed in this project and it is going to identify the problems and will show the warning messages or the errors whatever the uh, it finds also if you go to the project and uh, go to the source folder and uh, go to the java classes here you will see there is a something like a warning messages if you click on highlight you will see that replace this uses of system dot out or the system error by the local what it means is as this is my testing program hence i am giving as a system dot out dot println but in the case of real project it is always recommended that we use logos like a log 4j or slf or 4j these things instead of actually printing the output to the console hence it is giving a warning message or the uh, for the developer by saying that this is actually a not the correct way to handle the code so now developer can go ahead and integrated uh, the log 4j and can fix the issue and also if you go to the class level you will see add a private constructor to hide the implicit public one if you don't uh, implement any constructor for your uh, for your java class by default jvm will uh, will create a one public constructor and keyboard that is actually not recommended hence it is giving a suggestion that we always need to create an private constructor if you see private hello world okay now this now let us see see now this warning gone so once you update it automatically whenever you enable sonar lint for this project automatically it will keep track of what are the java files you change accordingly it will update now that error is gone now th that warning message actually it gone now it is saying this needs to be affixed but in the case of real time project if you replace this one with the logos this will also fix like that the sonar lint will give the developers at the time of developing the code it will give the warning messages so that developer can go ahead and fix this issue it will actually solve the actual problem so uh, let us go to java connectivity also here see in this program i have a couple of uh, more uh, warning let us see what means more array designation from a variable to the type so here we are trying to uh, trying to actually what we are trying to do is it is trying to uh, have the main method and then we are trying to do something but actually what it saying is like move the array destination from the variable to the type it is always expecting a particular type instead of a array and if you go to next one go here and see this means is remove this unused name variable and remove this useless assignment to the local variable even there are two things one i am not at all using this variable in my pro uh, in my uh, class at the same time i am not at all doing except just assigning then there is no use of this one so it is saying that i need to remove this line of code now i remove it next one is again it is see in the background what it is doing again it is trying to analyze the source code here you go if you see it is extra uh, is provided externally to the method and not sanitized before use so basically what it means is this is what we are calling as a sql injection instead of placing instead of instead of passing as a um, appending to the query parameter it always ask us to do in a different way that is statement dot set int of one comma emp id
now see so instead of sql injection uh, preparing the query passing as a uh, appending the input parameter if you use the prepare statement using this way this exception is gone so like that you need this uh, sonar lint will give you more uh, warning messages as a user friendly messages wherever we have uh, some issue so developer needs to go to there and they need to fix that issue so that it will improve the development um, uh, development uh, effort uh, reduce development effort will be reduced and it will improve the more uh, secure program we are going to deliver to the clients so hope uh, this concept is clear and uh, thanks for watching this video if you have any question please uh, comment on this video on YouTube thank you